Hi, it's Anthony from okplay.com and today we are checking out the AMVR silicone earmuffs for the Oculus Quest 2. So these have been specifically designed for the Quest 2 headset to enhance the sound of the built-in speakers that are located on each side of the headset and reduce the need to wear earbuds or headphones that can block out all the noises around you. Some of you might like that, but using earmuffs like these allow you to continue to hear the outside world around you whilst improving the sound that comes out of the built-in speakers. In the packaging, you get a pair of silicone earmuffs, one for each side of the headset, a short step manual on how to install them, and a warranty card that covers these silicone earmuffs for 18 months. They come in two colors. Uh, you've got the black ones here, and I've also fitted the white ones onto the Quest to itself, there you go. Um, along with the lead strap that fits onto the Quest 2. And this also works with the default stock head strap as well, the cloth one that comes with the Quest 2 itself. It will, however, not fit the halo strap that I have reviewed recently because of the bulky clips that uh, is used on each side of the Quest. These just don't literally go over them. They're, they're quite tight. Um, around the actual attachment point itself. The color is pretty much on point with the Quest 2's off-white color, maybe just a shade lighter. Being silicone, they are easy to clean, pretty indestructible. The round earmuff panels themselves are positioned on the inside of the headset, which means that they sit closer around your ears. This can create a better area around your ear to bounce sound around and to make the sound appear much more fuller. So I'm using the Elite Strap. That's with the earphones attached to your head. Check out the back. Because the ear earmuffs are inset, they really do sit almost on your ears, uh, which is great because the sound then just resonates so much better. If these were on the outside, you just get so much of the sound just lost completely. And it really is night and day when you put on a Kiwi design on one side and use the AMV on the other, you really hear the AMVR so much stronger than the Kiwi Design uh, version. Uh, so that's really fantastic on that side. Um, colorway, it looks quite good. It sort of matches the whole entire color of the Quest 2, which is nice. Um, you'll see the black one in a minute. It feels comfortable. These aren't really sitting on your ears as such. Uh, maybe this part um, can touch your, your neck if um, you're moving about because they are quite loose, this uh, silicone. Uh, and I'll talk about that in more detail in a bit. But yeah, but they feel good. Um, they definitely work quite well with the Quest 2 color scheme. I think it's a nice match and it's probably nicer that the ear flaps are on the inside rather than on the outside. They just give you much better sound overall. They do look similar to the Kiwi design uh, earmuffs for the Quest 1, which also fit onto the Quest 2, but their round panels sit on the outside of the headset, and because of this, a lot of the sound is almost lost completely. These earmuffs sound a lot better, louder. It's also helped with how well they are designed. And let me show you on these black ones here. So on the inside of the earmuff itself, the channel is um, closed off on this panel, whereas on the Kiwi design, you can see that it's fully open uh, design. So all the sound is just lost uh, once the uh, Quest 2 speaker emits out of its built-in speaker. Whereas the AMVR one, it's, it's, it, it's roughly situated here. The sound is gonna hit this area here, and because it's inset, it's actually a lot thicker. So the sound can resonate around here, and then you can see there's an exit point uh, and then the sound is much more stronger, so it can resonate around on this inside panel a lot more clearly. And it really is night and day. When you compare both earmuffs, you, it's like twice as loud at least um, on the AMVR than it is on the Kiwi design. Um, it is pretty much comparing apples to pears because these aren't really being made for the Quest 2, but um, AMVR has sort of taken this kind of design concept and involved it uh, specifically to use with the Quest 2 headset, which is great. 
It's a very simple design, but it really works really well and much better than the Kiwi Design's open concept. Now this isn't going to replace the total immersion of using earbuds or headphones, but these earmuffs, you're not messing around with finding uh, your headphones once you, and you have to attach them onto your headset afterwards and plugging them in. And you also get to um, hear people around you whilst improving the built-in audio from your Quest 2. Installation is really simple. So let me show you how to fit these black ones onto my Quest 2. Right, so we've got our Oculus Quest 2 here. We've shown you the white version. I'm just gonna almost do this in reverse just to show you what it's like to install the black versions we got here. Um, and uh, so I'm just gonna take it off first, which um, is a bit of, um, you sort of have to unhook it, slide them all the way back just to get access to the arms. So we need to take the rubber off, slide it back, and then pop the arms. And then this just slides off like that. This one too. And then we're just gonna get the black one on, so we're gonna have to quickly check. So this is the left version with the bit pointing downwards. So we pass that through the outside and then lift up the excess and bring them all the way back. And then get the other one. Pass that through. And they're both in like this. And then we basically bring the handles back on. And then we slide these back into place. So they latch over the top. And then this one as well, back over the top. So there you have it, this is the black one fitted. Then we'll get that one on our face and see how it looks. All right. So we have shown you how to install the AMVR silicone earmuffs onto the Quest 2. I'll quickly put it on so you can see how well the black one looks. So they're the black ones, they look pretty good. I think between white and black, the black looks less inconspicuous because you can't see this part as strongly as you can when you wear the white one. So I don't know what you think. Let us know in the comments below. Um, but this is the black option and um, I think it looks nice with the white and uh, especially if you pair it with the black accessories as well, such as the dark band of the, um, of the Quest. And if you get a facial interface kit or you just use the stock, black facial interface kit. It kind of looks great with that too. The AMVR silicone earmuffs cost $12.99 for a pair from Amazon. And you can check out the links in the description below on how to buy them. There are two issues I have with them though. The first is when wearing these, you can hear a white noise coming from the built-in speakers during periods of quietness in a game or during menus without music. I've adjusted the headset sound on all levels and you just can't get rid of the white noise that comes out of the built-in speakers on the Quest 2. This just shows you how well that these earmuffs are amplifying the sound that's emitting from them. And you do get used to it after a time, but if it's something that you think annoys you, then you might want to avoid these and just go without them on your Quest 2 or look at earbuds or headphones instead. The second issue is to do with the strength of the silicone AMVR has used. It feels like they could have done it a bit more firmer on the actual ear cup section so that they hold their shape more and not just flap around as much as they do. If you place your headset down, uh, they just buckle underneath. They don't really sit properly on the actual earmuffs themselves because they're just not strong enough to take the weight of the headband itself. And I think if they use a firmer silicone, I'm sure that they might have helped resonate the sound a little bit better around your ears too. But overall for $12.99, I could see past both of these two issues, mainly because they really do a, such a decent job at enhancing the sound of your Quest 2 internal speakers. If only the Quest 2 output better bass, then you might not need a reason to use headphones with these on. All right, thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give us a like and consider subscribing to all my future content. It really helps us out 
and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers. Bye.